Welcome to Hayward Connect. I'm Bruce Porter, Director of Marketing Communications for Hayward Pool Products, and we're live at the Atlantic City Pool and Spa Show in Atlantic City, New Jersey. We're going to be speaking here with Scott Petty, Product Manager for Pumps and Above Ground Equipment. Scott, thank you very much for joining us today and no coming problem. on site. Glad okay? to be here. Perfect. We're going to talk about how to make your pool more energy efficient. All right, Scott, what is Hayward's position today relative to energy efficiency? We, we know it's extremely important, uh, not just to Hayward, but for our customers um, with cost of energy going up. Uh, having energy efficient products for the entire pool is tremendously important. So we've got a variety of products that can do that. Okay, when you say a variety, why don't you give us a little... Uh... I'll do that. Okay. I'll start off, I'm a little biased being the pump product manager. Uh, <laughs> pumps are probably the biggest opportunity to save energy. When most people think about energy, they think about electricity, uh, you, what you got to pay on your bill. And pumps give you the greatest opportunity to save on that. You can save up to 90% on the energy cost of a pump by going to a variable speed pump such as EcoStar or our newest Super Pump VS and Maxflow VS. Now save up to 90% off of your pool's energy costs? Yes, versus a single speed pump that can only run single speed day in, day out, you can save 90% compared to that, which can be, depending on how much you pay for electricity, that can be as much as $1,500 a year. So these things, they're not only good for the environment, but they save you money. Save you money, so, so what you just stated means that I could probably pay for that pump in a single year. Again, one to two seasons is very common, depending on how long you run your, your pool, um, how much you pay for it, of course, what you pay in electricity. But in general, getting a variable speed pump, it's really a good investment. Not only is it uh, saving you energy, but let's face it, it's saving people money, which yeah. is the real benefit. Is the switch out or is the changeover to one of these pumps fairly easy if you were to take your existing pump out of your pool? Absolutely, and that's why we have a, a variety of pumps now, a lineup, so that depending on what kind of pump you have, you can select the appropriate variable speed to drop in. Very easy to, to do, and uh, service guys are very familiar with doing that, and that day you're saving money. From that day on, wow, that's that's exciting. That's really good. It, it really is. So, go ahead, you said you had a lot of products. Let's go to the next Well, product. again, the pumps are the single biggest in terms of electrical energy, but with energy efficiency in the Hayward Energy Solutions, it's not just about electricity, it's about uh, saving water, uh, saving time, saving chemical costs. So again, the pumps, you start with the pump, but you can look at all the products uh, on the pad, the filter, the heater, a variety of things. Well, you mentioned saving water. How do you go about saving water in a, in a pool? <laughs> it, it, water evaporates. Well, yeah, right? exactly. <laughs> uh, that comes down to the type of filter that you have. Okay. Um, there's three primary types of filters, sand, cartridge, DE. Uh, sand being very popular, but you have to backwash that. With a cartridge filter, you don't have to backwash, so you're not wasting water uh, by doing that. And when you're doing that, when you're backwash, you have to, uh, you're, you're dumping out heated water, chemically treated water, you're wasting water. With a cartridge filter, you don't have to do that, and you can save. Uh, but you, you do have to clean the cartridge. Yeah, you have to clean the cartridge, but you're, okay. you're talking about spraying it down with a garden hose as opposed to okay. you know, pumping out water at uh, uh, a high, high speed. What about cleaners? Is there any energy efficient cleaners? Absolutely. In fact, that's probably the second biggest opportunity to save energy is uh, going to robotic cleaners. Uh, again, like with filters, you got three types of cleaners. You got suction, uh, pressure, and robotic. Suction and pressure, they're great cleaners, but they're tied to the pump, meaning the pool pump has to run for those cleaners to run. A robotic cleaner, uh, however, works completely by itself. So you can run the cleaner without having to run the pump so you can save energy. And in fact, with a robotic cleaner, you can save, I think it's about 94%. So even more you can save compared to and other pumps. What powers a robotic cleaner? Uh, it already has its own built-in uh, motor. You literally just plug it in, it goes in the pool, does its own thing, and you can have it on a timer, so it's completely independent from everything else. So it's electric. Is that safe to have in your pool or by Absolutely. your pool? Absolutely. It, it, uh, it can be counterintuitive, but it's completely safe and listed to put that product in the pool. Just like you have lights in the pool, it's completely safe. Okay, all right. And and now that we're talking about lights, you say we have lights in the pool, are, are lights energy efficient? Absolutely, as, as uh, probably a lot of people know, you know, the uh, light bulbs have been incandescent or, or halogen for decades, but now with LED technology, uh, you one, save a lot of energy, and two, you get the flexibility if you get hundreds of colors that you can really customize. So with our lineup of LED lights, you can save tremendous energy, as well as really make your pool look like whatever you want it to. That's really interesting. 
Now I want to ask you another question that's dear to my heart, okay? Because I love warm water, okay? Okay. Tell me, tell me you have an energy efficient heater or an energy efficient way of heating the pool. We do energy efficient heaters and heat pumps. Um, and those are, are twofold. So one, how efficient they're designed in heating water, their BTU rating, if you will. Uh, but then also how hydraulically efficient, you got to pump water through it. And the more inefficient they are, the more pumping you have to do to get the water through it. Our heat pump and heater are extremely hydraulically efficient, so that means you don't have to run the pump as much, so you save energy that way. In addition, they're very extremely, uh, if you will, thermal efficient. They can heat the water very quickly. If you don't mind, you mentioned two products that heat, but I'm not so sure that everyone understands the difference between a heater and a heat pump. Can you just briefly tell us the difference between a heater and a heat pump? Uh, yeah, uh, basically it's, it's uh, first a heater is, is going to heat the water directly and it's usually typically going to be propane or natural gas. It's very rapid heat. Um, so when you want to, for instance on a spa, you probably have a gas heater because you don't want to wait around. With the heat pump, it can be extremely, it can be much, it is much more efficient, uh, but the trade-off is it takes longer uh, to heat the pool. So if you were an executive on your job and you were coming home from work and you wanted to swim in two hours, it would be much better to have a heater than a heat pump. It is, but with the heat pump, once you get it up to speed, it, it is very efficient to maintain it there. So another option is, uh, particularly in, in markets like Florida, they run the heat pump, it extends the season and they just keep it running that entire time and it just maintains a pool temperature. Okay, good. What about automation? Is there, is there any automation? Absolutely, everything that we talked about can be, can be and is efficient by itself, but when you get uh, Hayward Automation, it really ties it all together. Um, so the automation can control the pump, uh, can control the light, the heater, um, and so you really get to maximize your savings at that point. And, and your savings is, is endorsed by turning things on and off in an appropriate manner. Absolutely, so the, the most efficient uh, is by turning it off. So with an automation system, you manage what you need to do only when you need to do it. So if I got to run my heater, that's when I turn my heater on and, and if I have a variable speed pump, boost the speed up when I do that. As opposed to in the past, it was a single speed pump that was running all day uh, at the same speed. Uh, now we have something that can manage it and it makes it not only a lot more efficient, but frankly, a lot easier. I mean, who would buy a TV today without a remote? You know, it's well, that's just, true, that's true. You come to expect that stuff nowadays. So are any of these items time saving as well? Absolutely, again, okay. uh, particularly with automation, instead of having to go back there and, and manually press a button or turn this valve, again, you can't imagine life without a remote, you press a button, it does everything for you. Um, as well as uh, uh, we talked about on the filters, you don't have to backwash as often. You do have to clean the cartridge, but that's, maybe a couple times a year, as opposed to backwashing a couple times a month. So it saves you time, you're not, you're enjoying the pool, you're not having to manage the pool, it does it for you. Understood. Well, Scott, I wanna thank you very much. This was really good information and it looks like uh, Hayward's in the forefront on energy solutions. Absolutely, I appreciate it, thank you. Thank you very much. And thank you for joining us here at Hayward Connect. We're live at the Atlantic City Pool and Spa Show and I'm Bruce Porter, Director of Marketing Communications and we'll see you next time.